Hello, I'm the Anime Viewer 66, and today we're going to be taking a look at one dandy of a show. Ha ha, I hate myself for making such an obvious pun. Moving on, when I first saw this anime, I was like, oh great, this is going to be a cowboy bebop ripoff, bring on the jokes, all this sort of stuff. But as I watched it, I was like, this is so out there, crazy, insane, and that is what I love about it. It's its own thing in every way possible. Yeah, it takes tropes from Cowboy Bebop and actually certain other animes, but it's all its own in the fact that it's just so crazy. The premise of Space Dandy is pretty straightforward, but it can get crazy in like a drop of a hat. The basic premise is you have Dandy, a sort of space bounty hunter, wink wink, who goes around trying to collect different aliens who no one knew about previously and put them in a registry so, well, people can know about them. The problem is he's not very good at his job, so he has a cat space ferret thing and a robot with an awesome voice to help him. But literally at a drop of a hat, you can have this show go from just being a simple thing of you taking one alien from one place to another to being about zombies or the meaning of life or ramen noodles. This show goes pretty much everywhere and it's really cool for doing so. This anime basically doesn't link up with every episode. Like, one episode could have them be zombies, and in the next episode, they'll be completely fine. Now, as for the question if you're going to like this show or not, that'll really be up to your own personal taste, because first and foremost, this show really is a comedy, and comedies have a problem of being uh, different audiences like certain comedies, so just because I like this show a lot for its weird, crazy, sort of out-there comedy doesn't mean that you necessarily will. So depending on what you like, you will either love or hate or just not care about this anime. But for giving us an interesting story and some very cool visuals at times, I give Space Dandy three and a half stars out of five. It's definitely an anime I would recommend, though you may or may not like it depending on your tastes. I am the Anime Viewer 66. Thank you, and good night.